Hello, everyone. I'm Brian Sethurst, Chief Storyteller at Storytech Immersive. And I'm Caitlin Burns, Executive Producer at Storytech Immersive. At Storytech Immersive, we are so pleased to curate the 2020 VIF Immersed Competition and Exhibition. The category is Best in Documentary, Virtual or Mixed Reality. This category is designed to showcase immersive experiences created to document and explore an aspect of the real world. Before we announce our finalists and winner, we'd like to thank our jurors for their time, energy, and expertise. Our gratitude goes out to Jin Chu Chen, Larry Cutler, Jonathan Griffith, Eric J. Kruger, Dari Laverde, Tony Mugavaro, Solar Shana, Columbus Levin, Loretta Todd, and jury chairperson Valerie Creighton. The finalists are by the Waters of Babylon, from the United States, making its North American premiere. Directors, Kristen Lauf Schaefer and Andrew Halaz. Echosphere, Raja Ampat, from Australia, director Joseph Purdom. Full Circle, from Canada, making its world premiere. Directors, Naomi Kondo and Craig Commanda. And With the Wind in the Stars, from the United States, director Rachel Bracker. And now I'd like to introduce you to the chair of the 2020 VIF Immersed Competition Jury, the president and CEO of the Canada Media Fund, Valerie Creighton. And our final category is Best in Documentary, Virtual, or Mixed Reality. And the winner is By the Waters of Babylon. By the Waters of Babylon takes viewers on an immersive journey into the world of composers silenced by the Holocaust and a contemporary string quartet's mission to bring this music to a wider audience. Viewers begin their experience situated in the center of the Clarion Quartet as they perform a work by Victor Ullmann, a composer who suffered under Nazi oppression. By the Waters of Babylon then interweaves images of the past and the present as it tells the story of the Antarctic music composers and the Clarion Quartet's mission to shine light on music silenced by oppression. Congratulations and let's hear from the team. Thank you so much to the Vancouver International Film Festival for honoring this project and for making it available to audiences. We truly appreciate the opportunity to share a story of these composers silenced by the Holocaust and the Clarion Quartet's mission to make this music heard. 